everybody, I'm Emily and this is Bob. Good morning. Morning. My Good. name's Bob, I'm the Area Officer for Forms and Cleveleys. We are out and about today. What are we going to do today, Bob? Well, we've uh, we've got some statements to take today. Okay. We've got some naughty people who've been letting the dogs foul. So we've got some good residents who have actually witnessed the offences who are willing to help us by giving us a statement, which then means we can go around to the offending person, resident, and basically tell them what's happened and look at issuing them a fixed penalty, which would be a hundred pound wow. for letting the dog foul. Okay. If they don't pay that, then we we're looking at taking them to court. So if somebody, a resident, spots somebody who lets their dog foul or any environmental or any, crime. Or any environmental crime, what are the, what's the what what kind of path do we suggest that they go down? What's the first step that they should take to help us to report it? They, they can either report through uh, ringing contact centre the civic eight nine one thousand. Yep. They can use the online form on form the website. On the website. Yep. Uh, email. Cool. There's so, lots, lots of different ways. You cover dog fouling, um, fly tipping incidents. Fly tipping, yep. littering, any littering. any offences, any, any environmental. Hello everybody. So, just had a call. We've got some fly tipping. Underbank Road, Thornton. Okay. For this one today, if we find any evidence, yeah. or we've got anyone who's witnessed a vehicle, registration yeah. numbers, mm -hmm. evidence in the waste, then we can then follow that up, which we have done in the past. If okay. it's just rubble and we've got no witnesses, yeah. it's basically we just have to get it moved. And... Okay. Underbank Road, here it is. So what we're going to do, are we going to clear this out of the way and then look for evidence or do we look for evidence now? Well, we're looking, having a little look now, see if we can just see anything that's okay. standing out. Yep. Um, Obviously it's a lot to get through, isn't it though? The, yes, it, yeah. When it goes on the vehicle, the lads could have a look, see if we've missed anything. It yep. looks to me, though, because it's come out of a shed, it's yep. not really going to carry any evidence unless it's no. got anything daft in at the bottom. But at the moment, it yeah. just looks like what it is looks like what it is just a load of rubbish, rubbish. <laughs> i know so this could have been dropped off at a tip quite easily couldn't it it could yeah would it would they've had to pay for it to uh, go to the depending tip? if it was trade yeah if they were a trade then they would have to pay yeah to looks it like it's just come from a shed though doesn't it yeah. so they wouldn't have had to pay for this if they just separated it and, yeah and uh, took the bits and recycled all the bits and that they could have got rid of this for nothing yeah yeah hello so cleared it away we didn't find the evidence did we nothing in that one what we're gonna do now is give the uh, resident a call who reported the fly tipping just to say courtesy call really we've we've removed it we're now going back to where we did try to start an hour ago as you know this job's live so <laughs> we're dealing with calls as they come in and, and prioritizing work where the builders bag in the middle of the road <laughs> was more important at that time yep. than us getting a statement which we can pretty much do whatever uh, yeah within core hours nine till five the, cool. yeah so that's where we're gonna try and go back to now as long as the phone don't ring again yep uh, we can give you an update on how that went yep we've got a statement for the fouling yep go around to the address and look at issuing him a fixed penalty which would be 100 pound for the fouling yep so we've been to see the address of the dog fouling. Um, we couldn't find the person we were after. We spoke to the other half. Mm. Seems like it's going well and hopefully we'll be able to issue a fixed penalty, won't we? She's pretty much already admitted that there are offences, dog related yeah. offences that have been occurring. Yeah. And um, with the way we've, myself and Emily, have sort of like spoke through to her um, that what they need to do now to put this right is for us to go back and do what we need to do yeah if that makes any sense it does <laughs> so it was a okay. good good morning yeah it? so we've done fly tipping yes dog fouling we'll let you know if anything had any success comes from the stories today so that is us that's us that's us thank you very much thanks guys thanks. see you next time